devastating epidemic can start in any country at any time and kill millions of people because we're not prepared, because we're still vulnerable. Epidemiologic investigations are underway, but yes, it's certainly possible that there's limited human-to-human -human transmission. I'm declaring a public health emergency of international concern over the global outbreak of novel coronavirus. We have a window of opportunity. While the number of cases, more than 99% are in China, in the rest of the world, we only have 176 cases. Let's use this window of opportunity to really invest in prevention, to invest in control and prevent this virus from spreading. It's time to act. The detection of this small number of cases could be the spark that becomes a bigger fire. And if the world doesn't want to wake up, and consider this enemy virus as public enemy number one, I don't think we will learn from our lessons. We have over 400 scientists. There's been huge global interest in this topic and a real desire to collaborate and contribute. Our window of opportunity is narrowing. And that's why we called the international community to act. We've had enough countries now import disease. It is time to prepare. It is time to do everything you would do in preparing for a pandemic. All countries can be looking for cases right now. All countries can be aggressively finding those first cases and following those contacts over time. Shortages are leaving doctors, nurses, and other frontline health workers dangerously ill-equipped to care for COVID-19 patients. This is not a drill. This is not the time to give up. This is a time for pulling out all the stops. We're deeply concerned both by the alarming levels of spread and severity and by the alarming levels of inaction. We have therefore made the assessment that COVID-19 can be characterized as a pandemic. Not testing alone, not contact tracing alone, not quarantine alone, not social distancing alone, do it all. You cannot fight a fire blindfolded and we cannot stop this pandemic if we don't know who is infected. We have a simple message for all countries, test, test, test. We must get back to be able to uh, control this virus, live with this virus, develop the vaccines that we need to finally uh, eradicate this virus. Please work across party lines, across ideology. 
across beliefs, across any differences for that matter. That's how we can defeat this virus.